Welcome to Just Stories, we hope you enjoy the story. Affidors, The Good and Bad of Living with This Unique Breed, by Just Stories. Chapter 1, Introduction to Affidors, Understanding the Origins and Characteristics of this Hybrid Breed. Welcome to the world of Affidors. These beautiful and unique dogs are a hybrid breed, created by crossing an Airedale Terrier with a Labrador Retriever. The result is a dog with a distinctive appearance and a fun-loving personality that has won over many dog lovers in recent years. In this chapter, we'll explore what makes Affidors so special. We'll delve into their history, appearance, and temperament to give you a comprehensive understanding of what it's like to own one of these lovable dogs. First, let's talk about the origins of Affidors. Like many hybrid breeds, the exact origins of Affidors are somewhat unclear. However, we do know that the breed was likely first created in the United States sometime in the last few decades. Breeders were likely looking to create a dog with the friendly and outgoing nature of a Labrador Retriever, but with the sturdiness and resilience of an Airedale Terrier. As for appearance, Affidors can vary quite a bit from dog to dog. However, they tend to be medium to large in size, with a sturdy and athletic build. Their coats are typically short and wiry, with a range of colors including black, brown, and tan. Some Affidors may also have white markings on their chest or paws. One of the things that sets Affidors apart is their unique personality. These dogs are known for being highly intelligent, loyal, and affectionate. They love spending time with their owners, whether it's playing fetch or cuddling on the couch. They're also highly trainable, which makes them a good choice for families looking for a dog that can be easily trained and socialized. However, like any breed, Affidors have their own set of challenges. They can be highly energetic, which means they need plenty of exercise and playtime to keep them happy and healthy. They may also have a high prey drive, which means they may be prone to chasing small animals like squirrels or rabbits. Despite these challenges, many people find that owning an Afader is a rewarding and fulfilling experience. They're a great choice for families looking for an intelligent and friendly companion, and they're sure to bring plenty of love and joy into your life. In the next few chapters, we'll delve deeper into the specific aspects of owning an Afader, including training, care, and maintenance. So, whether you're a seasoned dog owner or new to the world of canine companionship, we hope you'll find this guide to be a valuable resource as you navigate life with your Afader. Chapter 2, The Benefits of Owning an Afader, Why These Dogs Make Great Companions If you're considering getting a dog, there are many breeds to choose from. But if you're looking for a friendly, intelligent, and affectionate companion, you can't go wrong with an Afader. In this chapter, we'll explore the many benefits of owning one of these unique hybrid dogs. First and foremost, Affidors are incredibly intelligent. Both Airedale Terriers and Labrador Retrievers are known for their intelligence, and this trait carries over to their hybrid offspring. Affidors are quick learners and can be easily trained to do a variety of tasks, from basic obedience to more complex tricks and commands. Another benefit of owning an Afader is their loyalty. These dogs are incredibly devoted to their owners and will do anything to protect and please them. They love spending time with their families, whether it's going for a walk or snuggling up on the couch. Affidors are also highly affectionate. They love to be petted and cuddled, and they'll often seek out attention from their owners. This makes them great pets for families with children or other pets, as they're sure to form strong bonds with all members of the household. In addition to their friendly personalities, Affidors are also very active dogs. They love to run, play, and explore, and they need plenty of exercise to stay healthy and happy. This makes them a great choice for active families or individuals who enjoy spending time outdoors. Another benefit of owning an Afader is their versatility. They're great dogs for a variety of activities, from hiking and swimming to obedience training and agility competitions. This means that you can find plenty of ways to bond with your Afader and enjoy spending time together. Finally, Affidors are generally healthy dogs with a long lifespan. Like any breed, they may be prone to certain health issues, but with proper care and attention, they can live long and healthy lives. 
This means that you can enjoy the companionship of your Afader for many years to come. In summary, owning an Afader comes with a wide range of benefits. These dogs are intelligent, loyal, affectionate, active, versatile, and generally healthy. They make great pets for families, couples, or individuals who are looking for a fun-loving companion that will bring joy and companionship into their lives. Chapter 3. The Challenges of Living with an Afader, What to Expect While there are many benefits to owning an Afader, it's important to be aware of the potential challenges that come with this unique breed. In this chapter, we'll explore some of the challenges you may face when living with an Afader and how to overcome them. First and foremost, Afadors are highly energetic dogs. They require a lot of exercise and mental stimulation to stay happy and healthy. If they don't get enough exercise, they may become destructive or develop behavioral problems. This means that you'll need to be prepared to provide your Afader with plenty of opportunities to run, play, and explore. Another potential challenge of living with an Afader is their high prey drive. Both Airedale Terriers and Labrador Retrievers are bred for hunting, which means that Afadors may be prone to chasing small animals like squirrels or rabbits. This can be a problem if you live in an area with lots of wildlife or if you have other pets in the household. Afadors can also be prone to separation anxiety. They form strong bonds with their owners and may become anxious or upset when left alone for long periods of time. This means that you'll need to provide your Afader with plenty of socialization and training to help them feel comfortable when you're not around. Finally, Afadors are prone to shedding. They have a wiry coat that requires regular grooming to keep it healthy and prevent matting. This means that you'll need to be prepared to brush your Afader regularly and take them to the groomer for regular trimmings. Despite these challenges, many people find that owning an Afader is a rewarding and fulfilling experience. With proper care and attention, you can overcome these challenges and enjoy a happy and healthy life with your furry friend. To help overcome these challenges, there are a few things you can do. First, make sure that your Afader gets plenty of exercise and mental stimulation. This can include daily walks, playtime in the backyard, and interactive toys or puzzles. Second, work on socializing your Afader from a young age. Expose them to different people, animals, and environments to help them feel comfortable in a variety of situations. Third, consider crate training your Afader to help them feel safe and secure when left alone. This can help prevent separation anxiety and reduce destructive behaviors. Finally, make sure to groom your Afader regularly. Brush their coat, trim their nails, and clean their ears to keep them healthy and happy. In summary, while there are some challenges associated with owning an Afader, with proper care and attention, these dogs can make wonderful companions. By providing them with plenty of exercise, socialization, and grooming, you can help your Afader live a happy and healthy life. Chapter 4, Training and Socializing Your Afader Tips and Strategies for Success Training and socializing your Afader is essential to helping them become a well-behaved and happy member of your household. In this chapter, we'll explore some tips and strategies for successfully training and socializing your Afader. First, it's important to start training your Afader as early as possible. These dogs are highly intelligent and eager to please, which makes them quick learners. You can start with basic obedience commands like sit, stay, and come, and gradually move on to more complex tricks and tasks. Positive reinforcement is key when training your Afader. This means rewarding them with treats, praise, and affection when they exhibit good behavior. Punishing or scolding your Afader can be counterproductive and may make them fearful or anxious. Consistency is also important when training your Afader. Make sure that everyone in the household is using the same commands and techniques to avoid confusion. And be patient, it may take some time for your Afader to fully master a new command or trick. Socialization is also crucial for Afadors. These dogs are social creatures and need plenty of opportunities to interact with other dogs, animals, and people. You can start socializing your Afader from a young age by exposing them to different environments and situations. This can include trips to the park, visits to friends' houses, and obedience classes. When socializing your Afader, it's important to be aware of their temperament. 
Some aphidors may be more outgoing and friendly than others, while others may be more reserved or anxious. Make sure to pay attention to your aphidor's body language and behavior to ensure that they feel comfortable and safe in social situations. Another important aspect of socialization is teaching your aphidor proper behavior around other dogs and animals. This can include teaching them not to jump on other dogs, not to chase small animals, and not to bark excessively. Training your aphidor to be a well-behaved and respectful member of the canine community will help ensure that they're welcome in a variety of settings. In summary, training and socializing your aphidor is essential to helping them become a happy and well-behaved member of your household. By starting early, using positive reinforcement, and being consistent, you can help your aphidor master a variety of commands and tricks. And by socializing them from a young age and teaching them proper behavior, you can help ensure that they are a welcome addition to any environment. Chapter 5, Aphidor Care and Maintenance, Keeping Your Pet Healthy and Happy Proper care and maintenance are essential to keeping your aphidor healthy and happy. In this chapter, we'll explore some tips and strategies for caring for your aphidor and keeping them in top condition. First and foremost, your aphidor will need regular exercise to stay healthy and happy. These dogs are active and energetic, so they require plenty of opportunities to run, play, and explore. Daily walks, trips to the park, and playtime in the backyard are all great ways to provide your aphidor with the exercise they need. In addition to exercise, your aphidor will also need a balanced and nutritious diet. Talk to your veterinarian about the best diet for your aphidor based on their age, weight, and activity level. You may also want to consider feeding them a high-quality dog food that contains a balanced blend of protein, fat, and carbohydrates. Regular grooming is also essential for keeping your aphidor healthy and comfortable. Their wiry coat requires regular brushing to prevent matting and keep it shiny and healthy. You may also need to take your aphidor to the groomer for regular trimmings. Other aspects of a fader care and maintenance include Providing them with plenty of fresh water at all times Cleaning their ears regularly to prevent infections Trimming their nails as needed to prevent overgrowth and discomfort Brushing their teeth regularly to prevent dental problems Keeping up with their vaccinations and regular checkups with the veterinarian It's also important to be aware of potential health issues that aphidors may be prone to these can include hip dysplasia, ear infections, skin allergies, and eye problems. By staying up to date on your aphidor's healthcare needs, you can help prevent these issues from becoming serious problems. In summary, caring for an aphidor requires regular exercise, a balanced and nutritious diet, and regular grooming in healthcare. By providing your aphidor with the care and attention they need, you can help ensure that they live a happy and healthy life as a valued member of your household. Thank you for watching our story. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss out on our next video.